You gotta have some bad things to say about a person. Oh. But I really don't have any bad things to say about him because this guy was a player. <laughs> We wanted to do a, uh, a, a different sport this year, try some football players on for size, so hopefully we don't get our asses tackled off the stage. Chris, you know, hey. I know Chris and I remember. How you feeling about tonight? How you doing? Oh, I feel yeah. fantastic. Sports Roasters, the roast of O.J. Anderson. We got the legendary Lang. That's right. Uh, Joe's hanging out. The license plate guy Joe's hanging out. Yeah. Kristen Carney, back here prepping. Very sweet. Prep. Very nice. Yeah, this, this is a legendary room. Absolutely. Room. <laughs> a lot of yoga. So O.J. started a great charity called the O.J. Anderson Scholarship Foundation. And it's, a, it's an amazing, amazing charity that helps yeah. underprivileged people that can't afford but are in desperate need of an education. And in fact, uh, LT is actually signing up as, for an application as we speak. But it's so cool. This is such a huge night. We've got OJ, Kato Kalen. Does a lot of appearances, always flashing the rings. Where are the rings, man? You didn't sell them, did you? <laughs> how much do you think you can get for them? Hold on, hold on. LT, how much can we pawn a ring for? OJ learned to wipe when he was three years old. A couple of months later, they taught him you're supposed to use toilet paper. <laughs> well, I used to do comedy next to Howard Stern. Now I'm doing it next to Howard Cross. We've got two of Howard Stern's leftovers and three guys that look like they belong in a UNICEF commercial. So this is how the whole thing will be tonight. It's up in there, ladies and gentlemen. So be careful, beware, whatever may happen, may happen. But just remember one thing. Whatever these fools say, I got the last word. <laughs>